Dude, Vanessa probably isn't up here anymore. Okay, that's just tough. Just. Bye. Tell us who the disguise is. Ugh, what does it even matter anymore? The mask is closer to you than what you can ever imagine. Come on, just tell us. Fine, the mask is... Did she tell you who the mask was yet? No, she fell off before she could even say it. Man this bites. Wait, she got away? She fell in the Atlantic Ocean which had probably dangerous fish, so rip her. Well... There is only one person we can go to that we can really trust. Hey Caillou and Rosie, what are you guys doing here? We have some information about the st the disguise. You are going to go to the VLAN party, and memory smoke them, if we could pull this off. We could end the drama with evil Rosalina. Did you hear that? Everything will be solved. We won't have to deal with the evil Rosalina anymore. Great. Now all we have to do is wait for the party. So what our plan is to hang out in this party a little bit. I think they all should be in this building. And why's the- Hey look, there are two good people in here. <laughs> Wait what did you just do? No time to explain, just run. Well gang, we did it, we finally captured the disguise. There will be cupcakes in the other room so help yourself out to it. We make a good team mommy, don't you think? Yeah Rosie, I agree. Great job Kalu, we did it. Thanks Brian, but I have this feeling that the disguise is still out there and is going to pop up when we least expect it. It's probably just stress about college, I guarantee they're in prison. Hey. What icing did you use on these cupcakes? Man, they're really good. Ha 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 You most likely might be right. College has been getting to my head lately. The disguise is most likely in jail. Greetings, evil Rosalina enemies. You might be wondering who I am. I am the disguise. I have sat here watching you all pathetically struggle, and now that I have got you, it's time that you all watch the destruction from me. Hey Leo, what are you doing here? I'm walking home from my grandma's house. What are you doing here? I'm getting ready to quit my job with Mr. Mark. Why? You can't just quit your job. The mask is still out there. Because I think my work is done, although they barely trust that I'm a good person. My plan is to finish college, then invest my passion. Okay, good future I guess. Anyway, you gotta roll. Okay, to my plan is to go up to Caillou, Rosie, Doris, and Boris, and destroy them. They have no idea that I am the mask, and I have to eliminate any possible threat. Hello? Hello it's Brian. You and your family better watch your back because I just... You just what Brian, give it up, it won't be long before people find out. You'll never get away with this, disguise. Or really.
Good news, Brian is laying in the hospital with a serious neck fracture. Wait, I thought he was on our side, how is this good news? It turns out he was the disguise. Now the disguise is finally done. Dad, you hear that, all of the crimes are done. Anyways I gotta get back to the old office, gotta go. You know, I think something fishy is going on. Why would Brian all of a sudden be a bad guy knowing he would be eliminated if he was a bad guy? Just because they believe the disguise is defeated doesn't mean my job is done. I still need to eliminate their family. I would be happy to help, with pleasure. Okay, so what I'm about to tell you might shock you, so you better listen carefully. It turns out Brian was disguised. Call along. Wait what? I don't believe this. He literally told me that he is quitting his job because people think he is a bad guy. Well, I am sorry Leo but he was just lying to you again. No, no 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 no, where is he? He is at the hospital with a neck fracture, meaning he can't speak or he'll damage his vocal cords. Wait what? I have to talk to him. Well I just said he has a neck fracture meaning he can't- Oh why do I bother he can't even hear me. Funny, he is smarter than me but couldn't get that through his head. I don't know if you can hear me or not, but I don't believe you're the disguise. Wait what, you're awake. By the way just in case you couldn't hear me. I do not believe that you're a disguise, but do you know who it is? Hmm, maybe you could write it down on notebook paper. Stop what you're doing. When I went to visit Brian, he wrote down on a sheet of notebook paper that he is not the skies. Wait, so who is it? He said it was, Mark. Mark? Would be Mr. Mark. Wow, that makes so much sense. Well if Mr. Mark is the disguise, he is not going to just wait for Brian to get better. Well GG Brian, because sometimes, all good things, must come, to an end. What is going on here? The dude in the red shirt tried eliminating Brian, the guy in the bed. Okay, I'll take care of him. Thanks Mr. Police Officer. Ha ha, silly bald boy, he doesn't realize what mistake he did. That's right, it's time to go eliminate them in a few. Okay guys, it turns out Mr. Mark was the disguise, now we can go. Well, well now, now that this, this evil Roslyn and stuff, stuff is gone, things, things are, are gonna, gonna be kinda, kinda different in this family. I didn't think we could do it, but if we believe in ourselves, we can accomplish anything we want. You know, it's been an adventure, searching for all of the evil people associated with the evil Rosina. I will never forget that. Hey Rosie, Mom, and Dad, do you think we could just take the time and stop and think about all of the times we had while trying to work for Mr. Mark? Sure, why not? Fun times I guess. But at least it's all over. Or really? Game over, Mr. Mark. I hate you all, you all suck. Come on Mr. Mark, 
you can spend the rest of your life in prison. Hold on, we shouldn't take him to prison, knowing that we should be on watch with him we at least have to do something. Actually I agree with Caillou, knowing that he could break out of prison without us knowing, I have thought of another form more punishment that could be better than prison. Wait, so what punishment are you thinking of that could be better than prison? You locked me up in a jail cell inside of your own guys' house? How is this any better than prison? It's way better than prison, if you got sent there, many criminals would tease you. Well I guess the red-headed girl was right, this could be better than prison. Well hello, Boris, Kalau, Rosie, and Doris. You might be wondering who I am. Well I am, the mayor of this city. Well hello, it is an honor to meet you. Why thank you. We would like to inform you that our team is impressed with your smart reflexes as keeping the city safe, and their understanding of true hero to raw sim. And as in result in that, we'd like to congrats you on, Hero of the Year. Thank you so much Mayor of the City, this is amazing. No, thank you Rosie, and as in reward of protecting this city, I'd like to tell you that your super jet is waiting outside. Thank you Mayor, but we already have a self-driving car. Do you want the super jet or not? Fine. Sure. Why not? Sorry for my apologies. Anyways, go have fun. This will be awesome.